to have something maybe with a Smith with a keeper here. Under center, a little bit different looking. Could be a keeper. Roll out for Daniel Smith as he takes it into the end zone for a Villanova touchdown. Really nice call by Chris Bowden. You try to stick it in the belly of the running back, and they're all crunched in the middle. They do a good job. So let's spread them out wide. You have Summers out there as an option in the passing game. I think Smith makes the right choice. Here's Daniel Smith on second and 13, steps up and fires it into the end zone. A touchdown to Zach Kirkston. What a decision by Smith. He kept his eyes downfield, Nick. That's the most important part. A lot of young quarterbacks have tucked that and they're looking to run. He saw Kirkston get behind the defensive back, kept his head up, threw a perfect strike to the senior Kirkston. Wildcats lead 13-0. Delaware is without the wide receiver, Chichi Amachi, the junior out of Bell, Delaware who is out today with an injury. Nice hole there. Yeah. Off and running is Will Knight, the freshman of the week in the CAA. He's been one of the best running backs in the entire conference, and he's into the end zone. A touchdown and for the, Delaware. Yeah, that's the answer Delaware needed. It's the CAA Rookie of the Year, Will Knight. He breaks that one, and he goes all the way to the house. He got through containment. I don't know where the safety was. Probably got sucked up a little bit, and Knight breaks it through and goes all the way. And then a big gain, the big play capability, 38-yard hookup between Smith and Bengelis as Daniel Smith has been fantastic. First and 10, he throws it into the end zone. Chaga Hodge has it for another Villanova touchdown. And they just spread the wealth around. This time it's just a go route out on the left seam. Smith throws it up high. The D-back falls down late, an easy catch for Hodge. Serious field position on that play. Daniel Smith, Smith going downfield for Shanga Hodge. He has him running with the football. Shanga Hodge will go into the end zone for a touchdown. A big time score for Villanova. Rock and roll indeed. What a day for Shanga Hodge. He just runs a post and he just outruns a defensive back. And Smith put it right on the numbers. And then Hodge takes it all the way to the house while Cats lead it 26 7. And Solomon at fullback and then Barley. As your tailback, Smith under center. A linebacker to block for your running back, possibly in D. Will Barley, who pushes into the end zone for a Villanova touchdown. For the Wildcats, their fifth touchdown here in the first half at 127 to go, lead 33 to 14. Good job by Paul Gratton there pushing that pile forward. Sixth rushing touchdown of the year for the freshman running back out of Upper Darby, Pennsylvania. They have the ball on the plus side of the field. Third and 15 for Villanova. Daniel Smith, a play fake. He's going downfield. He's got Shanga Hodge, a home run. Touchdown for Villanova. The third touchdown catch of the day for Shanga Hodge. A pickup of 10 yards, first and 10 at the 37. Under a minute to go in the third quarter. With Steve Pannone, I'm Nick Montagna. Great to have you with us. It's Daniel Smith to Chaga Hodge, who makes a wonderful turn, and he moves into the end zone. His fourth touchdown of the ball game. This is as good a game as I've seen by a wide receiver going up in a long time. Probably go back to Brian Finneran, the Peyton Award winner. What an outstanding game for Chaga Hodge. His third touchdown catch of the season. They will go for two, Steve. Like you said, as Pat Kehoe will roll out the lefty on a throwback, and they've got it. Two-pointer good. good. Yep. That was an easy throw and catch. Good job. Roll everyone out left. That's Owen Tyler, the West Hartford, Connecticut. He slipped to tight end. Actually, a running back, kind of a fullback. Slip him out to the backfield. He gets a touchdown. That makes it first and goal at the one-yard line for Villanova's offense. Jalen Jackson to the end zone. He's in. And he is official. in for a Villanova touchdown. Wildcats now put up a 50 spot on the hands. 54-25 with the extra point coming. Six-yard strike. Coleman went up and called that go for two again here. Seven catches for 83 yards and a score today for Gene Coleman. Will they run the Philly special, Steve? I think they're doing it again. Part two is Kehoe who catches it. Delaware ran a Philly special against Rhode Island, and they do it here in Philly against Villanova. How about them apples? Yeah, I don't know if you want to use that one down 24, but uh, it's the last <laughs> game of the year, so I guess you can pull out whatever you want.